What I want to show you is how to sell PDFs on Shopify. So if you've uploaded a PDF, you can essentially stamp the customer's personal details onto the PDF and lock the PDF so it cannot be edited. This prevents the customer from wanting to share it publicly to anyone else because their personal details will be attached to it. So what you want to do is install this app onto your Shopify store. You want to go into your dashboard, go to the apps page, click this button up here and it'll bring you to the Shopify app store and you can search for this app. Once you've installed it, it will show up here on this page. So then I want you to click it. Then go to the assets page, click upload new assets, then upload your file. And this is where you'll upload your PDF file. So you click on the PDF. Once it's green, it's uploaded. Then we'll go back to the assets page. And here it is. Here's the file that we just uploaded. So now what we want to do is apply the PDF stamp to this PDF. So you click on the asset. And here's the PDF settings. So currently it's disabled. To enable it, you go down here. You can click the default template. Click on that. Press update. Now you've got the default template applied to this PDF. If you want to edit the template, all you have to do is click here. Go to edit. And then here's all the settings you can change. You can change the text color. Let's say we put it to a blue. Change the text size to eight. Lock. So this is important for PDF stamping. So you want to lock the file to stop the customer from removing their personal stamp. If they can remove the personal stamp from the PDF, then it defeats the whole point of PDF stamping. If the customer's personal information is on the PDF, they'll be less likely to share the file with anyone else. And if the file is locked, there's no way they can remove it. So you want to press save. And you can go back to assets. We can go back to the PDF. And now we can attach this PDF to some products. So you go to this section. These are the products that are on the Shopify store here. So we can attach it to T-shirt large, PDF, zip file. Then all you gotta do is press attach. And now this PDF is attached to all of these products. And then what I suggest you do is go to the settings page and then customize your settings to suit your store. So we have a bunch of different settings here. You can edit the PDF templates, the email templates, limitations for downloads. You can add all sorts of limitations. You can even restrict customers to only download from a number of IP addresses. That helps prevent customers from sharing download links with others. You can customize the checkout settings. You can display the download links on the checkout thank you page. You can display the download links in the customer accounts. And you can even use your own email address to send the download links. And that's it. And that's all you need to do to sell PDFs on Shopify. If you ever get stuck with anything, just go straight to the support page, write your message here, and you'll be speaking directly to the app developers, which is me and Ben. And we'll get back to you pretty quickly.